Crystal ball, crystal ball. When will the market crash once and for all? Wait, when was that? I see. Welcome back to I Buy Real Estate, your free step-by-step -step guide so you can buy real estate. First, I want to state this, in no way am I trying to or want to start a panic. This is actually the opposite where I'm preparing you for what is inevitably going to happen. Also, as a disclaimer, I don't actually have a real crystal ball to actually know what will happen, but after studying previous crashes, market trends, and gathering all this data, here are my predictions to when the market crash will take place. If you look at the past two crashes, 2001 and 2007, both happened around September, October period. And if Trump becomes reelected, 80% chance he will, he won't need the help from voters anymore. You really think he's going to keep printing stimulus checks and keep the interest rates low? It's all manipulation now to keep the economy afloat so he can get reelected. If the market is not correcting this September, October, it's very likely it will occur next year. Now that you know the crash is coming, what can you do to prepare? Number one, stabilize your finances. Let me elaborate on that. Make sure you have no high interest loans, hard money loans, high credit card debt, anything greater than 10% interest. If you do, make sure to consolidate it now because interest rates are at an all time low. And be sure to lock in your rates as fixed and not adjustable. If you own real estate, for example, sell anything that you don't wanna hold long term, long term meaning five to seven years or more. Why? Because it typically takes that long for the property value to recover. Any real estate in a bad neighborhood, bad neighbors, too much repairs needed, non or minimum producing asset or even bad tenants. Those are just a few reasons. And I myself have sold four recently. Number two is to have minimum, the very minimum, a year to two years worth of living expenses set aside. You can't always depend on the government for stimulus checks, nor would you want to. There's only one person you can depend on, and that is yourself. Now that number one and number two are taken care of, number three is to have liquid cash available. This is saying that when most people are running away from the hills, winners run towards the fire. This is in times like these, where mostly anything becomes 50% or even up to 75% off. It's the best time to take on opportunities while the majority of the people are on defense. That's it. Hope this helped. Wait, listen. The crystal ball is telling me something. It says, be sure to hit the like button, the thumbs up like button, and subscribe button. Any questions or your predictions, Make sure to comment below and share to help others, to teach others, to prepare others for the upcoming crash. Hope you guys got something out of this. I'll see you guys on the next one.